How's it going guys? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Bill and today we're in the Bronco uh, just sitting out here doing a really quick install. Now there's a bunch of BYOD rails available. I've seen a bunch. Um, I had the uh, Archetype Racing one, the full thing. I ended up reselling it because I never put anything on it. The most I ever use is like single mount here in the middle and then um i've never really needed found a need for a phone mount or anything normally because i just use everything through the apple airplay in the uh, center console but um now i'm trying to work with using multiple cameras uh so not just that one but i have mounts for out there and a couple of mounts for other things and so um and the only way to control them is with the phone so now i do kind of need a uh a phone mount especially when i'm like going off-roading or anything so i could turn on the different cameras depending on what we're doing and i don't have to just leave them running and stopping every half hour to change out batteries so um but i was looking and i was looking at the different rail systems and everything and the arms that come out to hold your phone and I didn't find anything that I really loved and then I came across the site tack form which I hadn't seen them before but I just happened to come across them and they had a different solution that I really liked and it's just this little guy right here so instead of installing on the rail and putting an arm there it just installs right here uh, there's a little lip. I don't know how well you can see that There's a little lip there and that lip just goes right in here And it sits there and then you can put it wherever you want And then it's just two uh, Allen screws here on the bottom to tighten that up I figure Right about here would be the best like the furthest over to the left away from any of the uh buttons or anything would probably be best and we could just go ahead and tighten this up now when it came this was tightened and i was trying to snap it on there it wouldn't work you have to loosen the bolts up first and then you can slap it on there and then you can come back and tighten these bolts up and then that's it I mean, it is on there nice and sturdy Hey, the dash is going to rip off before that does so that's awesome now uh, they have a whole bunch of different clips and everything that you can use they, they have like this standard ball mount they got a clip here so if you had like a CB radio you could clip that on there or you can clip an arm to that so the configuration they got we are going to actually put this clip up here and then not use that ball at all so we can go ahead and take this this ball off and they provided all the tools and everything so it didn't even need to whip out any tools this is just everything that came in this little box so you see that everything kind of kind of keyed it's a little pin there I'll just set on there then we can get, put that screw back in Read that I'm not putting the ball down here on the bottom so they also give you a little blank off plate and just plug that in so that was one box the kit I got came with three little boxes this is the actual phone holder itself and it's just standard spring-loaded phone mount with the ball on the back and then this little connector piece and so this is going to clamp on here and then the ball goes in top so once we unscrew this a bit Put the ball in there. 
Look at that one there. And there we go. We can position it where we want. And then I'm going to grab my phone. Put it where it would be in a good spot. Like right there. And we're done. So yeah, like I said, super simple, quick installation. Phone is right there. So I have access. Like I said, I normally just use Bluetooth and hand controls and most of the controls on the uh, steering wheel, but like, if I'm off-road and I want to use the GoPro app to connect to different ones, to different cameras, and uh, so on. So yeah, I think that's actually going to work out good. It was a low cost. Uh, I didn't require some super expensive rail to go across. and. Like I said, I had one on there before that I never used. I use this, I'll mount the camera there sometimes. Um, and then that's it. So yeah, if you are looking for a quick, easy phone mount, this one is pretty awesome. I like it. Uh, I'm not sponsored, they didn't send it to me or anything. It's just one that I found while I was looking for one. So I figured I would make a quick video uh showing how it works uh so i hope you liked it if you did hit that thumbs up button if you'd like to see more videos like this in the future hit the subscribe button and i'll see you next time